Joining me now is BYU sophomore quarterback Jay Keeps, probably the most recognizable face on the BYU football team. Jake, I first just want to ask, what are your thoughts as you head into this big season? Man, it's it's an exciting opportunity to go into Pennon and and to have the opportunity to be partnered with ESPN and, and to you know be for our fans to be able to see us week in and week out and, and, and to go up and, and play this amazing schedule that we're going to play and um, I, there's just nothing but excitement around here and I think the buzz is pretty exciting. What's it going to take during camp? Camp's coming up just around the corner. What's it going to take to get ready for the, getting out of the gate strong? you got that tough schedule to start off with. Right. Well, we're just going to have to keep improving every day. And, uh, you know, I think our coaching staff's going to have us ready. It's just a matter of us uh, coming together and working hard in practice and, and uh, you know, really giving everything we have. It's not just the physical side of things, but the mental side of things, studying film and, and getting down the plays and understanding the concepts and the schemes and, and just being uh, one step ahead. And, uh, you know, really every guy on our team needs to be a master of their craft. They need to they need to master their position and what they're supposed to do on each and every single play. And, and if we're able to do that, I think we're going to have a very successful year this year. There's some pretty high expectations coming in. What the, What's that like? Well, there are high expectations, but we wouldn't want anything different. Uh, if there wasn't high expectations, um, it really wouldn't be that exciting. It wouldn't really be, um, that means we're not doing very well right now. And, and uh, so we, we want the expectations. We want we want that mounted upon us. And, and uh, it's, it's just a matter of how people handle it. And, and I think our team's handling it very well. I think it's motivating us. I think it's a motivating factor. I don't think it's something that we're relying on what other people say. It's it's in our hands. And uh, it's it's kind of in our destiny, in our hands, and we control our own destiny. So, um, you know, that's that's the position that you want to be in. And so we're we're excited about um, this opportunity that we have for our schedule, um, and we're we're excited for the to to reach those expectations that that everybody has for us. As you look back, 12 months ago, things were very different. Quarterback battle was coming up. Mm -hmm. Lots of different. Uh, what, what's the last 12 months been like for you? Well, it, it's been. I mean, man, it's it's definitely been a whirlwind, and it's it's really been surreal. I mean, there's there's so many great moments. There's there's ups and downs, and and uh, you know, I wouldn't take any single experience away. Um, it's it's helped me become a better player and a better person, and and uh, and a better leader for this football team. And and uh, I, I, it's just been it, it's really been something that has shaped and molded our team. Um, and 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 we really looked back on that last season and what could we do differently and we learned how to be what it takes to be a successful team at the end of that season so we're, we're looking to build upon that and every you know well pretty much all of our guys are returning so everybody remembers and still has that taste of last season in their mouth and, and they they, they want to uh, get after it this season and, and uh, have have a lot of fun last question just what do you do to get ready for a game what's what's your process to get ready on game day well I think it's you know obviously you got to get good rest you got to get good sleep and and uh, you know wake up and and you know BYU takes care of us so we always have a good breakfast and, and it's just getting in the mindset it's not overthinking it it's not um, getting so juiced up that you're too amped up for the game it's you know it's not being relaxed but just being in a calm state of mind and, and just you know being confident in yourself and being confident in your teammates and and, and knowing that you guys are going to go out there and win. It's not, I, I hope we go out there and win. It's knowing that we're going to go out there and win and, and have that confidence and not only your team but yourself that you're you're going to be able to come out and, and perform. And, um, you know, it's just, uh, you know, obviously listen to music, do, you know, uh, do my uh, pre-routine rituals. I'm very superstitious, so I have some, you know, crazy routines that I do that, that are just... You Anything know. you can tell me about? Um, well, when I put on my when I put on my gear and my jersey, I, you know, after the first game, I put, put on the same thing the same way every time. Um, don't change a thing. Uh, certain times during, during before in pre-warm-up, it's when I go outside and when I come in and when I go and put on my shirt or when I come in and put on my game pants you know there's just I it, it's stressful but I, I have to do it so <laughs> perfect all right thanks Jake all appreciate right. you joining me appreciate it.